on Glen Campbell's decline. He was in my teens, American and so pure. His Wichita lineman, so majestic and fine, he heard it on the wire. He was on his way to Phoenix and had the dreams of the everyday housewife. His works with Jimmy Webb were amongst the finest of the time. His smile so bright and white, the epitome of American greatness, such a handsome man, the sort that women swoon for and men admire. A glittering career he had, a true legend was he. Troubles came his way, but his star did not diminish. How sad he has become so old and frail, in such a tragic way, such a slow decline. But his voice and his sincerity have ensured that his music will endure and that it will be loved and cherished forevermore. And a poem that is connected because it was inspired by listening probably far too many times to the song Galveston. Why me? Why was it me, he thought, called her? Why? And for what? What do I know about Vietnam? Am I part of a bigger plan or just a cog in a wheel? Does it matter what I feel? What about the love of my life? I wanted her to be my wife. Will she cry if I die? Will I her fulfil? I will be changed, oh so strange. A Sunday school teacher. Changed, dark, maybe vile, alcoholic. After a while. Why me? For what? Why?